Hey guys, Nazi Tech Pro here. Today to a video talking about new Matrix movie in the works at WB from Drew Goddard directing and writing this upcoming film. Not including George Chowski's creative franchise, but one of them actually our super producer, Sue so S. From Dead Line right here as my source, new Matrix Live Action, you know, Live Action no, movie. In the works, WB, directed by Drew Goddard, who did for Marson, Corfield, The Cap in the Woods, with other films involved in it as well. As for Kiwi Power, you know. Drew Goddard, the Oscar nominated screenwriter of For Marson, a space film, who also directed The Cap in the Woods, Josh Reading film. Has been set in writing and direct the upcoming Matrix movie in the works as we know it because if it's gonna be a soft reboot or a creepy reboot, it, if it's a reboot, I can understand that because we want to make a rewatch and do it better. But it's a sequel to Matrix 4, this came out in 2021, not too far away uh, back then because Matrix 1 came out in 1999. That's the first one, but everybody's still liking it. But just two came out in 2003. That's something else. 2003, same decade, Matrix for what moves in. But this one, Mr. Gordon came out in 2003. Then we got this one, the third one, 2003. Then we get this one, 2021. Did you do so well? WB did a marketing that did that well. For Kelsey, Whatever it's called, got mad, or this, and they decided to want to part ways with WB and back then, you know, with Film Double Hell, so you know. But it's still an early days of whatever the court cast, Kyle we Kyle we use um crazy any method and Wally Fisper and huge Hugo Weaver and Jada Pinkett Smith are coming back. Goddard will produce a partner. Sarah. Sarah Esberg. Sarah Esberg of Moonlight. If. If. Beale Street could talk. Via their Goddard Textiles banner. Yeah, Drew came to want to be one of ours with a new idea. We all believe would be an incredible way to continue the franchise of the Matrix film going forward. Films going forward will by both Ottaway, Volkowski's, Lynn. I know you are, I know you are, um, Lily, Lily, and when they, when, when they, and Lily began over 25 years ago, offering a unique perspective based on his own web of the series. The character said, Jesse. Airman. Jesse Airman, Warner Brothers, most in picture president of producing entire team. A W B Discovery phone to Drew to be making a new Mexican way to continue the franchise that left off and make it more better or than worse than the fourth movie. And um, Kelsey's uh, spent quality time uh, building up their ways to keep the franchise after we just four, commits for the did so well, and what's this way? So, also, based movies like this one, um, got her credit count is $1.5 billion, school box office received, and uh, Academy Award nominee to his screenplay for Marsons. 
directed by Richard Scott, the stupid person, by Ward Alien, and starring Matt Damon. <laughs> Good person, Matt Damon, Ward Scott, bad person, we don't even find dress. Okay, um, separate people, but Ward Scott is still stupid. Anyway, because he went anyway. And, um, Drew Goddard, Death Fields, White War Z, Corfield, The Marsons, and the episode of Daredevil, the Netflix series for it, they got White Scott back from, 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 from Disney, because Disney still got the Netflix TV show, because that's their character, because Disney owns Marvel, so Marvel characters, Daredevil, and the rest of the are owned by Disney, so, you know, it's a bit separate what I'm talking about now, but, you know. Also, Goddard begins Corey Whiting, 90s Buffy anime series, Buffy TV series by, by Josh Whedon. Uh, other things like Angel, Was, Daredevil, and Great, The Good Place. And other stuff going forward, like, right here, right here, right here. Okay, so, like I said, I'm happy about we getting a Norwegian movie that will hopefully be better than the fourth one. But, like I said, it is a problem now for Hollywood going forward. It's, like I said, you make a bad movie by Matrix 4 that did, did decent in the box service, but did you so well. Depending on the meat weed, likes the film or not, or the story acting, wait, maybe like wait, kind of what you use. But this film. Matrix 5 needs to be good, it needs to be great, it needs to be exciting, it needs to bring back the feel of the first Matrix movie. If they want to bring it back, they need to make a reboot. But we can make a soft reboot, bring, bring him back, kind of leaves. But how are we going to bring, explain what's going to happen on Matrix 4? The movie came out in 2021 and did so well in the box office, and Tchaikovsky's what saw that film when they made that film? I bet Joey B was in the middle, the high of middling, and saying to himself, Well, we need to change this or change that to get better for a site now or do something with it. I don't know. But, like I said, Drew Goddard, I trust him. He did the Marson, uh, we went to Marson, he did Parts of Cloverfield, he did the Daredevil TV series that's still good. I did watch it recently. Just two days ago, it was so good to say quite a board game comes out. But also, um, like I said, if you guys decide for a Matrix movie to come out, you should be excited first by Drew Goddard directing besides Rikowski's. But also, the Rikowski is still, the one with Rikowski's are still, it's actually producing this film. So it's to maybe like a Wiggy Scott situation, like to produce her, Wiggy Scott, put a franchise, do new alien movie, we want it, and which Kowski is a sick producer for their own creation. And now someone takes it over, like Drew Goddard. So that's a good thing. So we, we see what happens going forward with this film. If, if the cast coming back or anything else going on in this film going forward. So guess what you know? Take care, Naji Tech Pro. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Take care. We watch this movie coming out in development for Matrix 5. And take care. Peace and bye. See you comfortable about this topic. And see you soon. Bye guys, take care.